What up, viewers? Brandon Novak here. And I'm Joe Franz, and we're here to answer questions for SkullandCrutches.com regarding our upcoming graphic novel project, The Brandon Novak Chronicles. So as we're recording this, it is March 2017. The graphic novel is one half done, so please, no questions on where can I get it yet. It's not out yet. Okay, SkullandCrutches.com asks, why a graphic novel instead of a normal book? When we first started this, we were going to make a sequel to, um, to, oh, it's upside down. There we go. <laughs> yeah, Real professional, professional as always. Right? This is uh, the second edition of our book, Dream Seller, and we were writing the follow-up sequels, and there was a bunch of stories that didn't kind of fit in the narrative. And they, to me, were the most interesting stories, but within the character arcs and the framework of the book, they just didn't fit. And we were talking, I said, why not a graphic novel? That's how it started. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I gave uh, a copy of this new book to somebody out in LA recently, and they're like, wow, I felt like I was in your shoes. So we figured what next best way to bring them more into the story than like drawing it. A graphic novel brings more life to the book. You know, it's not just black and white words on paper. It kind of makes the words jump off the page. Nothing sucks you into the moment more than a graphic novel. So if I'm in this, in this abandoned, gray, dilapidated building with, with needles and cookers on the ground, what better thing than to let you see what I'm seeing? through my eyes. So another thing that Skull and Crutches wants to know is what is the involvement of CKY in this graphic novel? Our featured story in the graphic novel is a CKY story. You're gonna get this crazy CKY adventure that involves Novak on drugs, <laughs> Wake Yon, Chris Rabb, <laughs> Phil and April Margera, Bam Margera, and Ryan Dunn. And we don't want to give you any spoilers here, but CKY fans are gonna go out of their minds. This is an extension of the CKY universe, and we're not going through a publisher. Oh, you want to explain why yeah, we're not going through yeah. a publisher? Yeah, Th this is one of the things I'm most excited about. Uh, I was very adamant to cut the publishers out, to, to cut any provisions or red tape that we would probably uh, incur because we always do to to let our artistic views come to life without any suit and tie saying no you can't do this this can't be done this way what if readers are under 12 or whatever the case is we have the freedom to do creatively whatever whenever we want yeah we wanted to bring you the raw story we didn't want to have an editor saying this isn't teen friendly the publishers and editors they limit our work and our artistic integrity and We've never had to do that, and we never will. We're so, not going to. And this is an independent comic. So if you like, for example, um, the works of Robert Crumb or Daniel Klaus or Peter Bagg, you're going to love this. That's your phone. Real professional. The artist, Emmanuel Koch. How do we recruit him for the project? Um, Emmanuel Koch, and check the description for the link to his Facebook. If you're not friends with this guy, you're missing out. He's a brilliant German illustrator and artist and animator. His cartoons are great. And I mentioned the fact that I was going to do a graphic novel and I was looking for an artist. And he was like, hello, I'm here. But I, I think it's like a, a lot of other brilliant things that have happened in our lives. Usually they tend to be right in front of our face. I know once I started seeing the work that he was producing, it was like quality. And right there, we knew that was the guy. I believe he brings the vibe to each chapter to life. He can do comedy or tragedy. Each comic is drawn in a completely unique style. He's simply amazing. With that, we are running out of time. The good news is we have an official trailer for the graphic novel, The Brandon Novak Chronicles. To see that, click the link in the description box and I guarantee you won't be disappointed. So if you have half a man's ass, you might want to gain your senses and jump in on this. What if they're a woman? Well, have half a woman's ass. I like both. Whoa. I haven't had half a woman's ass in two years. Uh, cut. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good.